Hey everybody, Brian here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I wanted to show you guys a tip that I have learned actually off of another video. Um, and it has to do with water filters. So uh, with that, let's get to it. All right, water filters. Uh, just about everybody has seen or heard of the Sawyer squeeze or the Sawyer water filter systems. Uh, if you've been backpacking at any time or you go, go out at any length of time. And uh, it's just about a necessity. We all need water. Um, the one I prefer is the Sawyer squeeze. I have, have bought in the past the Sawyer mini when I first started. This thing does the job, but it uh, is very slow. The flow rate on it is pretty slow. So if you're in the market for one, I would recommend the Sawyer Squeeze. But I'm not here to do a review on the actual filter today. I just wanted to show you a little tip or trick that I found. Um, with these filters, after a few uses, they have to be back flushed. And uh, I would recommend, and I believe Sawyer recommends, to actually back flush these filters you know, every time you get home or after every use. Far, not as far as every use in the field, but when you get back home to uh, back flush it, it has like a hollow membrane fibers in here, however it works, I don't know, but I'm not dead yet. But uh, so the flow, it even says on the flow, it shows you on here, you know, you'd put your smart water bottle bottle or the um, bag that comes with it. Thought I had one here, I guess I don't. But uh, the bag actually screws on and water flows through. It's got this cap and you can flow it into another bottle or you can actually just drink right out of this. I just prefer to out of the bag or out of another uh, smart water bottle and uh, into a bottle, you know, a, like a clean bottle that I designate for clean water. But uh, when it comes to back flushing, what you receive with your filter kit is this big giant plunger and uh, to back flush these, they want you to screw this cap off and there is a little inlet right there. So you would take your clean water, suck it up with the syringe, and on the end of this, it would insert into that, and you would push the clean water back through. Make sure it's clean water, obviously, that you're pushing back through to clean all the uh, filter out inside there. But as you can see, this is bulky. I mean, it's actually a little bit bigger than the filter itself. It doesn't weigh as much as the filter, but it's pretty bulky. I mean, who wants to carry that backpack? So what I've seen some other people doing, I thought I'd share with you today, is if you are a smart water, bo water bottle user, um, I like to buy the bottles with the sports cap, just a flip cap. Um, it's nice to keep in my carrier or on my sides of my backpack. And it's just drink out of, and I'll carry it, you know, like a one liter with just a regular cap on it. But what these caps are great for, not only just for quick access to your water, but they actually will slide right onto that inlet right there, just like so. So to back flush, take your clean water, slip it onto that insert there, and now you push it right through clean water filter. You can do that all in the back woods, you know what I mean, while you're camping. Um, many of you probably have experienced this at one time or another, you've had to get water out of a questionable uh, water source and um, it'll clog these you know quicker than you think sometimes so you know filter some water up get you some clean water you can pop that on there if the flow rate's getting slow boom uh, another thing you can also do with these is have your empty catch bottle and if you have another bottle attached to here when I've done this before screw it on you can set this up you can even sit up against a tree and just let a gravity flow into there and uh, that works pretty well also. But just a quick uh, tip I want to show you guys. As um, far as, you know, so you don't have to carry this huge plunger in the backwoods. Um, basically, all you really need is this as a screw on to just about any water bottle, I do believe. So, uh, but smart water bottles, pretty much what everybody carries. Um, the life water bottle will work as al also as well. The, uh, the cap on that bottle, if you get the sports cap, it will work. But, uh, that's all I needed to show you guys today or wanted to show you guys today. So with that, if you like this video, give me a like, um, comment below if you have any other questions or if you guys have any other tips as far as uh, 
water filtering and purification or either back flush in these. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider subscribing. And uh, we'll see you on the trail. Thank you.